Because when we account for the changes in diagnosis and that exponential increase that we saw in autism, well, there still is a smaller real increase that remains unexplained. Maybe genes and environment working together could explain that. Also, autism is often talked about like it's this one single thing, but we should really be thinking about it more the way we think about cancer. Now, the key difference is that cancer is a disease that we try to cure, while autism is not an illness, it's a form of human diversity. But like cancer, autism is not one condition. It's a whole family of complex conditions with different causes and presentations, and they're shaped by this mix of genetic and environmental factors. I mean, we're just trying to understand ourselves better, right? That's the whole point of science, you know, to know more so that we can ask better questions. And I guess with that, you know what we say. Stay, Stay curious. curious. And as always, thank you to everyone who supports the show on Patreon. Episodes like this one take an immense amount of work. We're only able to do that because of the support of our patrons, 